This conference will now be recorded. Hi guys, welcome to Ratan IT. So my name is Ratan. Yes, we are discussing Korja assignments, right? Korja assignments. Yes, in this video, we will go for this assignment uh, regarding while loop. Uh, using using like you know while loop. So check this assignment, guys. Uh, after check, check, checking this assignment, you can please pause the video. After pausing the video, try to try to write the code first. You try to write the code. Then after completion, just you can start the video. Check the answers what I written right. Yes, you don't see the complete video, guys. Just you can pause the video and try to complete this assignment. It's very simple, guys. In application, take the guess number twenty five. In application, take the guess number 25. One guess well you can take some lottery number. Lottery number. In application, take the guess is 25. Take the guess from end user. Okay. Take the guess from what end user. When the end user is entered, the guess number is less than 25. Give the message like you enter less than 25. Enter again. As you taken 25, right? You taken 25. If user is entered less than 25. We need to give the message you enter less than less than guess value. Enter again. If user is entered like greater than 25, you enter greater than written, greater than guess value, enter again. If we if you want to stop the loop, guess if user is entered the guess value equal to 25, then your guess is correct. Congratulations, stop the execution. This is the point, guess. In application, take guess number 25. I mean, take application, take the guess number 25. Take the guess from end user. If user is enter the guess value less than 25, like he enter the 12 or 13 like that. If you enter the guess value less than 25, you give the message that you enter less than guess value, enter again. If you enter the greater than 25, you enter more than guess value, enter again. If you enter the equal to 25, your guess is correct. Congratulations. Stop the execution, right? Exactly. Just tell me here, do you know how many times to repeat the loop? Here yeah, the clue is, here do you know how many times to repeat the loop? We don't know, right? Because uh, he entered the 12, 13, 14, 35, 25. I don't know when he entered the correct value, right? In this case, you don't know how many times to repeat the loop, guys. If you know how many times to repeat the loop, uh, if you know like 5 times, 6 times, you can simply for loop. For int i equal to 1, i less than 6, something like that. But here you don't know how many times to repeat the loop. It's very, very important, guys. If you don't know in the real time when to stop the loop, we don't know how many times to repeat the loop, then you can take the while of while of what? While of true. Because while of true means what? This loop is keep on repeated, repeated, repeated. While of true means what? Automatic loop is started, right? Loop is keep on repeating, 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 repeating. While of true means what? Infinite times repeated, right? When you want to stop the execution, guys, when equal 25, just to check the if condition, if guess um, double equal 25, then you need to break it. Only when this is matched, then what happens, guys, loop is breaked. Otherwise, while of true means what? Loop is keep on repeating, 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 right? Yes, yes, sir. No. While of true means loop is keep on repeated, repeated, repeated. Just keep on rotating. When you want stop, if guess double equal 25, then break it. Only when the guess double equal 25, then only it will, be, it will break the loop, right? I think you got the clarity now. Yeah, while if you don't know the number of iterations, then use the while loop, guys. If you don't know number of iterations, then use the while loop, right? Exactly. Just let me write this code. So let me take one project here. New. I want to take the java project the java project is what so assignments assignments just you can take some project in click on the finish don't create the modules i don't want yeah just you can go for src folder right click uh, new i want to take the class yes class the package name is asking the clip side is asked the uh, package name right yeah class name is what uh, test one class something like that you can take click on the finish because I hope everyone knows this line, like, you know, how to write the code in Eclipse side. Yeah. Let's check the code. What is the requirement? Tell me. Uh, take the guess value is 25. Okay, fine. Yes, let me take the int guess equal to 25. Take the guess value from, okay, take the guess value from end user, right? Yes, sir. Huh? Guess, take the guess value from end user. 
after sorry take the guess is 25 guys then we need to take the guess from end user to take the guess from end user we know that scanner class required scanner scanner equal to new scanner of then we need to take the system dot what in right because we need to take the system dot in <coughs> that way because i want to take the guess from end user so enter the guess value <coughs> enter your okay guess value right enter your guess value guys when we enter the guess value how can you take the value tell me scanner dot uh, value means next integer right next integer then you can take the user guess yes user okay user user guess right exactly the scanner dot next int i'm taking the user guess so i have the guess number like 25 and i take the guess from end user I need to match the data. You want to repeat one time or multiple times? Multiple times. Then you can take the while of true. This while of what? True. Because here we need to check the if condition simply. If, uh, <coughs> tell me guys if, uh, if user guess, user guess is double equal to guess value. Because both are same. User guess double equal to what? Guess value. If user guess double equal to guess value, Tell me guess. User guess w equal guess value. Then we need to give the message that you know. Okay, congratulations. Guess is correct. Congratulations. Tell me guess. Uh, congratulations. Uh, your guess is correct. Your guess is what? Uh, your guess is good. Stop the loop, right? Then how to can you stop the loop here? Break statement. That's it. Because otherwise you want to take this number one time or multiple times or multiple times, right? That's what I mean. You please take this code inside the while loop. Like that, we need to analyze, guys. You want to take the data one time. Huh? Out of the loop, if you place the code here, this code, if you place out of the loop, then the loop is repeated how many times? Tell me. The code is taken only one time, right? <clears throat> That's what we need to take the inside the loop, guys. Then user guess double equal to guess means what? Congratulations, your guess is uh, good. You won the gift. Something like message you can write. You can write the else if, tell me guys, else if, uh, else if condition. What else if tell me? If a user guess, uh, tell me, user guess what the user is entered, which is greater than guess value. Then user guess is greater than guess value means what? You entered, tell me guess, you entered, uh, you entered what? More than guess value. Because this is the user guess, right? User guess is a more, greater. Greater means what? You enter more than guess value. As you enter what more than guess value right? exactly because if both are same means break if you user guess is the more means what you entered more than guess value you enter more than guess value enter again right yes enter enter again yes other than this the same message greater third condition i don't need to check what the third condition tell me you entered less than guess value tell me yes you entered what the third condition I no need to check, right? The third condition what? Other than these two condition, you entered what? More than or less than? You enter less than guess value, enter again, right? Yes, that's it, guys. We complete the code. Hmm? So just you can check the code here. I take in the guess value into guess equal to 25. Take the guess value from end user. I take in the scanner class. Enter your guess value, store the guess value user guess. While of true means what the loop is repeated, repeated, repeated. How many times repeated? Until you enter the correct value. When user guess double equal to guess. Guess when the user guess is double equal to what am guess, then only the loop is stopped, right? Is it clear now? The user guess double equal to guess, then only loop is what am stopped. Are you clear now? There is information, guys. Yes, that is the code, guys. Enough. I think you're showing some warning message. Scanner is never closed. Fine, let me close the scanner object. Scanner dot what? Close. That's it, guys. This is like the code what we read. Sorry, clear, right? Yes, can you please check the requirement clearly? It's very simple things, right? Yes, simply can run this code. Right click here, run as Java application. So enter the guess value. I enter like 12. 12 means more than guess value, less than guess value. It's like less than guess value. See? 
you enter less than guess value enter again you get the point right loop again repeated or not again repeating enter the guess value is like 34 you entered more than guess value enter again enter guess value you enter 2 less than guess value enter the guess value i entered 89 more than guess value i entered minus minus 25 it's minus 25 means what uh, less than guess value when I enter the 25 correct value, then what happened, guys? Congratulations, your guess is correct, right? The loop is keep on repeated, guys. When the loop is stopped, when the user guess w equal to what? Guess, right? I think now you got the clarity about the while loop, right? When to use while loop. When to use while loop means if you know the, hmm, tell me, if you know the, if you don't know number of iterations, if you don't know number of iterations, then simply you can take the while, while of true. Yes, if you don't know number of iterations, simply you can take the while of what? True, right? That's information, guys. Then loop is keep on repeated. How can you stop that loop? When the condition is matched, break the loop. Only when this condition is matched, then only break it. Otherwise, loop is keep on. Uh, loop is keep on repeated, right? That is the information, guys. Because I think you got the clarity about this answer, right? You please uh, execute the code, every line of code, you please execute it. You please don't, uh, don't see the video, don't uh, stop the video. Just you need to see every line of code and you need to execute the code, see the output first. I hope you guys are doing the practicals, right? Yes, you please maintain the notes about these all assignments. You maintain the notes and you please inform your friends also regarding these assignments. At least say that they can understand, right? Annoying. your friend also will get a good subject so clear no? guys can please uh, like the video comment the video hmm? comment the video yes. comment the video like the videos and uh, subscribe to my channel to get the more videos you got the point right yes bye guys meet in next video we'll go for one more question